Amen. Do take your seats and turn again, please, in the Word of God to Genesis chapter 45. I believe that apart from the story of the Lord Jesus Christ, that the story of Joseph could be said to be the greatest story in the Bible. In fact, it is my own personal opinion that the story of Joseph is the greatest story that has ever been told. It is so moving, so filled with emotion, twists and turns that reading it for the first time, you really wouldn't know what's going to come next or what the outcome is going to be. At times, you pity Joseph. At times, you're moved with admiration for Joseph. And at times, you're ready to just burst out in tears with Joseph. So moving has it been that even non-Christians and ungodly men have sought to dramatize it in theaters and on television. I personally can hardly read these chapters in the book of Genesis without a tear coming within my eye, the emotions of my heart being pulled. And I say that as someone who is not uh, normally an emotional person. And yet, such a moving story is this that it brings a tear to our eye most times that we read it. The story tells us of a young man who was cruelly uh, sold.